I'm Samantha McKelvey, and here's what made news this week. On Wednesday, Stanford's Independence Day fireworks returned after a three-year hiatus. Fireworks by Grucci provided a 26-minute display, which was viewed by many from Cummings Beach. Residents say they are thrilled to have the fireworks back. I'm really excited because I missed it a lot. It was one big event that we come to every year, spread out the picnic area and have fun. Governor Dana Malloy made a visit to Norwalk Monday to discuss urban violence with city officials and community members. The panel discussed mental health, school safety, and crime rate statistics. Well, I think it just highlighted that the dialogue is necessary to bring everyone together. It's not a Norwalk problem, it's not a Connecticut problem, it's not a it's a community problem, you know, so we all need to come together and discuss the issues and find out what the solutions are and work together to solve it. In Greenwich, local residents and officials celebrated the five-year anniversary of the Armstrong Court Community Garden Saturday. The garden was presented a certificate of recognition from the Connecticut General Assembly. The garden donated 600 pounds of food to the neighbor-to-neighbor -neighbor food pantry. Sometimes the stereotypes dominate the way people view our town. And as a resident of Greenwich, I am especially proud of the diversity, the diversity of viewpoint and background and activity that we have here that often is unappreciated elsewhere. I'm Samantha McKelvey, and that's what made news this week on itsrelevant.com. Have a safe and happy 4th of July.